Hey guys, you're welcome back to join me in this channel. My name is Baldwin and I'm here to show you how to make money in crypto. If you love digital cash and want to make some money in crypto, kindly hit the subscribe button below. Today, we are in Africa's cleanest city, Kigali, the capital of Rwanda, where digital transformation is accelerating the country's growth and reducing poverty. The government of Rwanda has made it very easy for its citizens to be acquainted with the digital technology that is speeding up the country's growth and making it a cashless economy. Rwanda is among the countries in the world that nearly all the services provided by the government institutions are paid via digital payment methods like mobile money, visa card, and online banking apps. But what about crypto payments? Mobile money. Mobile money. Mobile money. Tigo cash. Mobile money. Although Binance in its P2P trade has added the Rwandan France as a trading currency with zero fees, the Rwandan cryptocurrency laws are not still favorable to crypto enthusiasts since the government has not currently enacted regulation or legislations specifically uh, regulating digital currency in the country. In 2018, the National Bank of Rwanda, NBRO, warned the population that anyone who gets involved in the business of buying and selling digital currency or digital money will do it at their own risk. In the same year, Bitcoin P2P trading company Paxful launched a development crypto crowdfunding project to build the first Bitcoin school in Rwanda known as Zamzam Nursery and Primary School at the Nyamata sector, Bogesera district in Rwanda. Africa is becoming the undisputed leader of financial liberation with Bitcoin and other digitalized tokens like the e-Naira launched by the government of Nigeria with mass adoption. Just like the e-Naira in Nigeria, the National Bank of Rwanda NBR is studying the development and issuance of its own digital currency as an action to minimize the country's concern about the anonymity, stability, and regulation of the digital currency. Downtown the city street of Kigali, we tried to get connected with IT students and other techno experts in the country to find out their say on digital innovation, accessibility and adoption in Rwanda and Africa as a whole. We met with Brighter Digital Business Group or Brighter Digital Group, a company that has been working hard to create awareness of digital products like SPEN, a payment app and also on the blockchain technology. Technology. Yes, Mr. Frank, as he has a word to say. Hi, Frank. Hi. Thank you so much. You're welcome. Uh, thank you. Um, um, uh, first of all, Brand Digital Group uh, is a blockchain news network a company aiming at leveraging uh, an extensive knowledge and experiences in digital technologies with the sole aim of uh, creating uh, community awareness, particularly around blockchain technology and uh, digital technology in general. Okay, uh, you are one of the founding fathers of uh, Brighter Digital Group in Rwanda, and you recently got an award uh, from the African Blockchain Institute this uh, May 2021. What are some of the challenges uh, Brighter Digital uh, Group is facing as far as uh, creating mass awareness of the blockchain technology uh, in Rwanda? Uh, first of all, uh, we are not dealing with uh, uh, Bitcoin or crypto sort of things. We are uh, focusing on blockchain technology as a whole. And as you know, Bitcoin is just a slight very thing uh, uh, with regard to this blockchain technology. 
So, um, there are uh, some misconceptions about the blockchain. People are confusing it with uh, uh, Bitcoin and cryptocurrencies. And this is why we took this step ahead uh, to educate and explain and uh, carry out uh, campaign awareness around this technology so that people could understand very well what is really blockchain technology and what is behind it.